So what should we study today? Sir, Matt, sure, I have like a summative on uh, uh, HCF and LCM factors and multiples and uh, so when is your summative? next week, somewhere between then. So math summative, HCF, LCM factors, multiples and divisibility rules. Specifically, divisibility rule seven. Divisibility rules. Yeah. And two more things, factors and multiples, and HCF and LCM, which we just started today. Our topic is called the time machine. Basically, we're recapping everything we learned. So that's why. All right. So find the answer for these two questions. So do you remember the method, the guy, or you have forgotten? Forgot. To find the HCF, LCM? Oh, that I remember. I forgot how to do this. You forgot what? How to do this. This, okay. I kind of uh... so first you combine the signs and then you add or subtract. Oh yeah, I remember. I think so. So please everyone send to Ragini ma'am. Don't send to me. Zapman answers are correct. Oh sorry, ma'am, it was a typing error. Said that you uh, have gold. I do. Can't you hear my voice? Uh, yes. But I miss gold today. So, Namisha's timings have changed. Yeah. So, is Mr. Bambi here? No, P. And expects me to feed him. And did you drop him today? Sort of. Oh. And you came back also with him. What? You came back also with him. No. He was saying. I went with him. Like he was Guys, no talking, no talking. Let's do the question. Already done, sir. sir That's right. It's correct. Oh, no, sir. I think I sent it to you accidentally. Yes. Fine, it's very good. Oh, yeah. Okay. This always happens in the beginning of class to me. I don't know. So, Geet and Adhya and Smiley Time up. All right, guys, let's look here. So the first step we have to do while doing solving our integer questions is combine the signs. So the signs should be together without any digit between them. To combine the signs, the signs should be together without any digit between them. So keep these two signs will become what? Plus. Yeah. No, beta, just say these two will become plus. So it will be minus 5 plus 20. Do you understand? Yes or no? Yes, sir. So now are the signs of 20 and 5 same or different? Different. Different. So whenever different signs are there, it means one is profit, one is loss. One is profit, one is loss. So what do we do? We subtract them. So it's basically 20 minus 5 because the profit is more. So we will get 15. Understood, Geet? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Now check the signs of these two. Are the signs same or different for both? Same. Same. And another thing I wanted to ask is, can you combine the signs? Yes. Uh, no. By combining, I mean, are the two signs together, Jinko, you combine kar pao? I didn't get it. 
बेटा सी लाइक मैंने प्रीवियस एग्जाम्पल में कंबाइन किए थे बिकॉज द टू नेगेटिव साइंस वर टूगेदर ये भी मेरा लॉस है ये भी मेरा लॉस है सेम साइंस मीन्स एडिशन सो वी आई विल हैव टू एड ट्वेंटी थ्री एंड ट्वेल्व आई विल गेट थर्टी फाइव and because both were losses so i will have to put minus 30 all right so i have a question b part b part can you explain hmm. again b part yes i think if you don't understand now what i'll do is i'll take an extra class for the kids who are you know who have not done this in the last year see guys pehle mai let me explain the concept in once again in details these are my questions minus 21 Minus plus fifteen. Minus or let it be, uh, let it be plus plus sixteen plus minus twenty three and seven minus seventeen minus eighteen and minus fifteen minus minus sixteen. See kids. No, no, beta. I am explaining the kids who have not done this last year. So, see, whenever you have these type of questions, the first thing you will do is combine the signs. Because if two signs are combined together, you don't know what is the operation, what is the number. So, first thing we combine the signs which are together. Without any digit between them, which are together, without any digit between them. So Geet, Gauri, and uh, Basavi, you keep on unmute, guys. Now tell me, are these two are uh, in the first A part? Are any two signs together without any digit between them? Yes. Which one? So minus, minus and plus. Minus and plus. So tell me the step by step. I mean combine the signs. Tell me the first step. Quickly, Vasavi, you do so. Sir, minus uh, plus equals to minus, so it will be minus twenty one minus fifteen. Minus twenty one minus fifteen. This is understood, Geet. Yes, sir. Okay. Next, you speak the step for the second part, B part. Speak quickly. Plus and minus equals minus sixteen minus twenty three. Sixteen minus twenty three. So Gauri, you speak for the third one. Can we combine signs? Uh, yes, sir. So Smiley, beta, we cannot combine signs because in I signs we need like digit. One. We cannot because these two signs have a digit. Gauri understood? Yes, sir. Pakka sure. So this will remain as it is only. सी यहाँ पे जब दो साइंस थे देवर टुगेदर विदाउट एनी डिजिट बिटवीन देम व्हेन वी वर डूइंग द ए पार्ट द साइंस वर टुगेदर विदाउट एनी डिजिट बिटवीन देम बट इन द सी पार्ट इट्स जस्ट सिंपल देर आर द साइंस आर नॉट टुगेदर दे हैव डिजिट्स बिटवीन देम सो वी कैन नॉट कंबाइन देम सो फॉर द डी पार्ट गौरी विल यू टेल मी द स्टेप फॉर द डी पार्ट यस So, uh, so we can combine, uh, combine the signs. We said that there is no division between them. So, sixteen and sixteen will get sixteen. Uh, I cannot hear you, beta. Just speak the step. So we'll get Just speak minus. the step. So What are you saying? Fifteen. Ah, uh, ah, uh, sixteen minus fifteen, which will be one. So basically, you are saying minus fifteen plus sixteen, correct? Yes, which is correct. Now, E part smiley, can you combine the signs for me? Yes, sir. Yes, combine the signs for me and give the answer. Minus seventeen, minus twenty three. Correct. Now stop here. Now by combining the signs and step, I mean that no two signs should be together. 
So now I don't have any two signs should be together. Now I can recognize or identify the numbers. This is a negative number. This is a negative number. Now when two losses are there, your losses combine. So Geetal, what will be my answer? Quickly give it to me. Uh, minus 36. Minus 36 is correct. Smiley, next answer. Yes, sir. So the 16 minus 23, 1. Yes. So just one second. So minus 9. Minus 9, beta, kaise hai minus 9? Did you subtract them, 23 and 16? Yes, sir. You will get minus 7, bitter. Your subtraction was wrong. Next, yes, minus 17, minus 18. Gorish, what will be my answer? So, we'll add them. So, we'll get... Uh, uh, so, 35. We'll get minus 35. Minus 35. Minus 35. Very good. Because both were losses, I added them and had put a negative sign. Next, Vasavi, minus 15 plus 16. So, it will be minus 1. Plus 1, beta. Mera profit jada hai. 16 is a positive number and it's greater. So, we will do 16 minus 15. I will get 1. But it will be plus 1 because my profit was more. Understood, Vasavi? Yes, sir. One more question for you, Vasavi. Minus 17, minus 23. So, we will add 20, uh, 17 plus 23. Yes, I will get 40 then. 40. Will it be plus 40 or minus 40? Minus 40. Minus 40 is correct. Now, guys, a little bit I will explain you multiplication and division of negative numbers also. Sir, so, I there is... Multiplication. Better, let, can I explain better? Can I do my job? Yes. Thank you. So, in multiplication or division, there is only one rule. Count the number of negative signs. Count the number of what? Negative signs. Count the number of negative signs. In what? In multiplication, division of number of negative numbers. Of negative Numbers. So, so sir, we are going to start with a new concept. If the number of negative signs are even, then my answer is positive. Negative, you will. And if the number of negative signs are odd, then what happens? Uh, answer is negative. Answer is negative. Sir, will we do calculations with um, multiplication and division? Or a little bit we'll do, beta. Not much. A little bit we'll do. So please note it down, guys. If you want to note it down, you can note it down. For example, minus 2 into minus 3 times. That's it. So what will be my answer? The question goes to Mr. Ba. What will be my answer? So the answer will be 6. The answer will be 6. We will multiply normally, but I have two negative signs, so it will be plus six. Now, next question goes to Chatty, the Vetty. So, minus five times one. Minus times one, five times one. Chatty. Minus five. Minus five. One last example. 
minus 3 multiplied by minus 4 multiplied by minus 5. So, so number of negative signs are 3. So who wants to answer? Mr. Van Lee? Sir, Chippy. Sir, I want to. Sir, I want to. So, Mr. Bambi, what's your answer? Um, sir, so the answer will be... Um, minus 65. Sir, it will be... Uh, sir, Masabi, only... Masabi, Peter, don't speak in between. Sorry, no. 60. Yes, Mr. Bambi? Sir, 60. Beta, minus 60. The number of negative signs are 3. 1, 2, 3. They are odd. Okay. All right. I got it. Okay. So everyone do the next two questions. Minus 1 into minus 2 into minus 3 times minus 4. And B part minus 1 into 5 into 3. Sir, I have a question. Yes. Why are you using brackets? We can use brackets, beta. Generally, we do use brackets between <laughs> negative integers, especially. <laughs> yes, Miss Chappie, you can go to get your water bottle after getting the answer. You can get the answer fast, quickly, and then get your water bottle. But you have to get the, get the correct answer because water is important for life, but so is education. Mr. Bob. So this is not a part of the grade six syllabus. But we will you you know a little bit we'll be using it in linear equations. So that's why I'm making you do because this concept will be used in linear equations. Otherwise, this concept comes in seven seven seven. Linear equations is one of the most difficult concepts of grade 6. But, like, if you understand it, it then is it difficult? It needs practice, but this linear equation needs more practice. So, I'm not able to do this. You are not able to do this? So, let me explain. So, Miss Smiley, can you multiply 1, 2, 3, and 4? Yes, sir. So two what will you get? Two, 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 six, 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 24. 24. Now count the number of negative signs. How many negative signs are there? Four. Four. So is four uh, even signs or odd signs? Is four even number or odd number? So even. Even. So my answer will be plus 24. Because negative signs, two negatives makes positive, two negatives makes positive. So my, jahan bhi do negative ho milke, they will become positive. Do negative milke become positive. So my answer will be plus 24. Understood, Smiley? Yes, sir. Now, next question. Uh, I will ask the answer from, uh, you also understood, Mr. Bambi, your mistake? Yes, sir. Sir, I got it. Are there? What will be my next answer? Sir, 15. Peter, how many negative signs are there in this? One. One. So, one is an odd number or even number? Odd number. Odd number. So, whenever we have odd number of negative signs, means I will get minus 15 as the product. Okay. Understood, kids? Yes, sir. Sir? Yes, sir. But, sir, minus 1 into minus 2 is like, are we using the magic brackets? That's why it comes. No, beta, no. 
we are not using magic brackets. It's just a concept that when we multiply negative integers, then two negatives make a positive. Then how? Minus one multiplied by minus two gives me plus two. Then how plus two? Beta, because so minus, two negative minus signs. Plus. No, okay. yes, you can say that minus minus makes plus. You can say that. Okay. But yes, then, sir, so if you're doing if you're doing something like minus one times minus two times minus three, then it wouldn't be same, right? So then it will be negative. Yeah, then it would be negative. So then they were saying that negative uh, two like negatives make a positive and like. It's not that necessarily true. All right, all right. So what else should we do? I think we'll jump to reasoning now for some time. What do you say, guys? No. So break, so break. Sir, yes. So break. Sir, yes, reasoning, reasoning. <laughs> reasoning, reasoning. <laughs> Yeah. Break, break. Yes. Okay. Can I give you an introduction of linear equations? I want to teach you linear equations. Yes, I will be teaching. Yes. Listen to me. Yeah. Can you keep so your you have given us break in two days. You want to learn linear equations. Sir, so okay, okay, okay. So linear equations I will be teaching you two times. One now, one after some time. Because it's very tough. So, Candy, Dia, keep your camera on. So, when we do it just for one time, we may get confused. But when we do it for two times, we have a very good chance that we will understand the concept much more better. So, for the first time, let us let me try that you understand in first time. So, every linear equation will have variables like x, y, and z. Every linear equations will have variables like these. Do we understand? Yes. And their power will be 1. So it will have variables and constants. It will have variables and constants. So what are these variables, guys? X, y, These e. variables are A, B, C, X, Y, Z. All these are called variables. And what are constants? Jinki mujhe value pata hoti hai, like normal numbers. 5, minus 10, 50. There are so, normal numbers in... in UI will come in the variable and uh, smiley will come in the constant. All right. So I am unknown. Yes. Because Satu is always unknown. My to mankind. father is not known. So then Dia, camera on please. Dia, Dia, oh Dia, Dia, oh Dia, oh Dia. Dia. Yes, Dia. he gone somewhere. Yes, yes. Dia had gone somewhere. <laughs> yes, Dia has gone somewhere. Yes, yes. Dia, keep your camera on, beta. Okay, sir. Now, linear equation will always have, also have, and guys, this I'm just explaining. If you want to take a screenshot, take it. I'll be taking this unit again after two months. So, for now, linear equation will also have an equal to. Linear equation will have an equal to sign. All right. So then, if I write something like this, 2x plus 5 equal to 10, is this a linear equation? Yes, yes sir. Then how is it equal 
So this is a linear equation. So what is this 10 and 5? They are constants. Constants. And what is this x? Variable. Variable. So why do we call it variable? Because its value we have to find. Sometimes when you study higher mathematics, a variable can take multiple values. But for linear equation, you will have only one answer. All right. Yes, sir. So then. Sir, what about the yes. two, with, two with the x? Doesn't that the two is a constant as well? Generally, beta, it is merged with x. We don't, if we, agar kuch bolenge to, we will call it a way, constant only. But generally, yaha pe mera 2x combine hai. So generally, 5 and 10 will be called as constants and x will be called as a variable. Okay, okay. suppose next 7y plus 5. Is it a linear equation? I will ask one by one. Dia, Odia, Uriya. She is not in tattoo. Can you call Dia's mom? Because she is not in the class. Tattoo? Can you call her mom? I'll pick up only. Because I think I should be starting number. Alright. So, Hacker, is this a linear equation? Yes, sir. No, sir. Alright. Yes or no? Yes, sir, it is. So, the guy, is it a linear equation? Yes, sir. Smiley, is this a linear equation? Yes, sir. Sir, can I keep it in? Gauri, is it a linear equation? No, sir. Sir, can I attend? Gauri, is it a linear equation? Yes, sir. Sir, can I attend? It's actually yes, not sir. a linear equation. Sir, it is not a linear equation. It is not equal to sign. Because there is no equal no to sign. No equal to sign. Because there is no equal to sign. So this is not a linear equation. Yes. Sir, I have another class. Can I also leave in five minutes? Oh, today I had to keep the time early. Sorry, Mr. Blah. And uh, I forgot, kind of forgot. Chalo, from Please next Wednesday, I will try. So you can leave after five minutes, all right. Now it's not a linear equation. Now what about, then what is it? If it is not a linear equation, it's just then we called it, we called it algebraic, algebraic. Expression. algebraic expression. We call it expression. What do we call it? Algebraic expression. Is algebra uh, a subject or a part of math basically? Part of mathematics. So, what is algebra? Wherever we use this, all these funny kind of variables, A, B, C, D, S, A, 2. This is all a part this? of algebra. All right. This? So, this is called the algebraic expressions. So, then, have we understood, kids? Yes. Yes, sir. Cut off. Yes. So, do you know that 2 into 2? Can be written as 2 square. How many of you know that? Yeah. Raise your I hands. I need to know that. Yes, so I am square or like real hands? So anything. So if I multiply 2 into 2 into 2, because I am multiplying 3 times, I can write two, it as 2 cube. Two to the power 3 or 2 cube. Two. Again, this is not in your syllabus. But I have told you because we'll do an intro of everything so that we can say high concept right now so that we understand when it is used in our questions. But so I this think concept... it is... So I think it is in physics. So what is y into y? Can anyone tell me? Sir, 2y. Sir, y no. into 2. Sir, y into 2. Sir, y, y squared. Y squared. Y squared. Y squared. So y squared. it will be y squared y squared. or y to the power 2. Yes, right. What is y times y times y? 
अगेन नॉट इन अवर सिलेबस बट आई जस्ट वॉन्टेड टू टेल यू that y is different y square is different y cube is different so i think all this is in physics now when we study linear equations we will only study y we will not study y square we will just study y x z we will not study z square oh, not study z cube y plus not study z to the power minus 1 And Why? not study one by x. Can you please explain what it is? Peter, I am saying, जब हम linear equations पढ़ेंगे in grade six, we will not study about z square z. We will only study about x y z. Means जो power होगी वो one. Sir, what will be the power one? What will be the power one? Oh, I okay. need to leave, sir. I'm getting late. You are getting late, sir. Yes, sir. The class is far from my home. Okay, Mr. Mammy, you can leave. I'll send the recording. Next class, beta. मुझे एक बार remind करा देना. I will keep at six five on Wednesdays. Okay. Okay, sir. 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 So it is just for Wednesdays we can do six five. So I won't be able to join. Why? I won't be able to join. Sir, I can do that. Sir, sir, I can do it. Chalo, let's say anyway we'll discuss it later. If you can do or if you can't join. Now, yes. Sir. Yes. Can you explain this again? I got disconnected. I can explain this again. Beta C. Two multiplied by two, two square. This you understood. So, Maher, unmute, beta. Yes. Have you understood this? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Then two multiplied by two multiplied by two, two cube. Correct. Yes, sir. Same way. Y into y, y square. Y into y into y, y cube. So I was just explaining this that this we will not be using y square. Y cube, Z square, Z cube, Z to the power minus one or one by x in linear equation. In linear equations, we just will use x to the power one, y to the power one, z to the power one, or just x, y, z. Okay. Means the equation will be. Listen to me. Then we will not do A B C D E F G H I J K L. We can do A B C D E F G H also. Means your equation will have will not have five x square equal to ten. It can have five x equal to ten. जो x की जगह x cube नहीं आएगा. This will not. This is not a linear equation. This is a linear equation. This is not a linear equation because x to the power three. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, Candy. I won't be able to join early on Wednesday because I have my other class ends at six. Okay, beta. Okay, we'll sort out something. Then, Dude, then let's see. Two power seven x cube not a linear equation. Because जो उसकी power है वो three हो गई. The power should be one only. कोई power नहीं है. जैसे मैंने x लिखा. It means x to the power one. Okay. 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 Now, then the next thing is, what is five plus five? Ten. Everyone tell me. Ten. 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 So can I say five plus five is actually five two into five? Can yes, I say sir. that? Yes, sir. Now, if I write five plus five plus five, can I say that it is actually three into five? Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So in algebra, sometimes my x plus x plus x will be what? Three into two yes. x. Yes, sir. Understood? Not understood? Understood. Understood. Now, but. We don't use the multiplied sign. We can use, but we generally don't use. 
sometimes in books they will use dot sign instead of multiply and most commonly they will not use any sign they will just write 3x 3x ka matlab kya ho gaya 3 multiplied by x all right yes sir so why is so common why did we use it 5y ka matlab kya ho gaya 5 multiplied by y why Yes. One more. What is two x plus four x? Sir, six into x plus four into x. Six into x. Six into x. It will be six x. We will add two and four like normal numbers and then put x sign. Sir, why don't we how? Then what about x? Uh, the yes, two numbers. How? What, what now, will how happen? will we find the value of x? Beta, we cannot find. I am just explaining you the basics of linear equations. I have haven't started the chapter yet. जब आप chapter हम करेंगे, you will understand. Let's say seven y plus five y. What will be my answer, everyone? Twelve y. Twelve y. 5y minus 7y. What will be my answer? Minus 2y. Minus 2y. Like normal integers, 5 minus 7 is minus 2. So I will get minus 2y. Sir, I have a question. All right. Yes. Uh, what would happen if you do 5y subtracted by like 7x? So very good question. I am coming to that. Now, y and y terms can be added, subtracted, and we call them like terms. We call them like terms. Like terms can be added, subtracted. I can add them, subtract them. But 5y minus 7z, I cannot do anything with it. Because this and this are unlike terms. This and this are unlike terms. What are they? Unlike terms. Unlike terms. Now, Should... can we... I add 5y square? One second, beta. Can I add 5y square plus 2y? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Oh. It will be... Uh... They are also five, unlike, five, beta. Five. They are not same. So, we cannot add them. 5y square and 2y are... Different terms. Wow. different terms. I will take. Let's take y equal to 2. First number kya ho gaya? 5 into 2 into 2. Yes. Second number kya ho gaya? 2 into 2. This is 4. And this is 20. Right? Yes. yes sir. You got 24. Agar aap isko 5, 7y likh dete, it would have been 7 into 2. 14. Correct? Yes, sir. Sir, I did not understand. But I have just taken y as 2. So, I have y ko likh liya, 2 into 2 because y square means 2, y into y. Okay? But sir, then that is not the linear equation. Yes, that is not the linear equation. Chalo. This is just an introduction I have given you. The concept, now we will begin a little bit with the concept. According to the book. Oh, in grade five. Can we have a break now? No, beta, yes. no. We didn't this have break. Like, we are doing such a big grade. Sure, we are I'm doing very such sleepy. a big grade. Sure, in bigger grades, we need longer breaks. Longer breaks or no break? Longer Long breaks. Break. Then you do not more. Stuff so you get more tired. Sorry, yes, please be a break. No, beta, no, no break now. So now, guys, variable ko sometimes we write literal also. So how do we write the sum of literal x and a number five? How do we write that? Five x. X plus five. Understood, not understood. Understood, sir. Not understood. Not understood. Let us sum of literal x and number 5. 
इंग्लिश है चैट Y more than x is written as. Now all these we are doing are not linear equations. They are. Represent to Ragni ma. Algebraic expressions. Represent to you or Ragni ma. Ragni ma, ma'am, please paste the names. So I understand. So y so more than x answer. is written as दिया आपने जो लिखा है ना वो inequality लिख दी मुझे expression लिखना है y more than x all right let me explain don't worry so y more than x will be x plus y or y plus x was simple that's it then how why more than हाँ ah, तो y x plus y Compared yes. to like y is my y minus x is equal to how much y is more than x? बेटा y more than x जैसे मैं आपसे बोलूं two more than five. वह minus से minus three. That is five plus two बेटा seven. If I ask you how much is Five more than two. Sir, I did not understand Three. how come we are adding plus instead of that comparison sign. Sir, even I did not understand. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Oh. One second, guys. One second. अगर मुझे x और five add करना है, it will be x plus five. Understood? First one understood? Yes, sir. Now this is example. Two more than five will be five plus two. Understood this? Yes, sir. This was example. As Sudram asked. Now Sudram was asking, "Ki if subtract kyun nahi hua? If your question is how much is five more than two, then I will subtract Sudram. Got it? Sir, but I don't understand. One by one by one, bhai bhai. Yes, Sudram, bolo ap. But sir, it's written five more than x. तो फाइव मोर देन एक्स एक्स प्लस फाइव हो गया ना लाइक वाई कुड बी ग्रेटर और स्मॉलर टू एक्स बेटा वेट वेट हो जाओ वो इनइक्वालिटी है वो हम नहीं कर रहे हैं दैट इज इनइक्वालिटी वी आर डूइंग एल्जेब्रिक एक्सप्रेशंस थोड़ा सा ट्राई करो गिव फाइव मिनट्स यू विल अंडरस्टैंड नाउ फाइव लेस देन एक्स को हम कैसे लिखेंगे सो बट देन व्हेन द वर्ड डन कम्स इन इट ऑटोमेटिक थोड़ा सा वेट करो फाइव मिनट टेन मिनट वेट करो यू विल अंडरस्टैंड फाइव लेस देन लिटरल एक्स इज Just take thirty seconds. Nahi aaya, I will tell you. All right, look here, guys. Y less than x so will be x it. minus y. Because I have to subtract y from x. 
प्लेन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज है y लेस देन x मींस y हैव्स टू बी सबट्रैक्टेड बाय x गौरी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वेट वन सेकेंड लेट मी टर्न ऑफ दिस सर आई डिड नॉट अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट यू डिड नॉट अंडरस्टैंड बेटा सर द क्वेश्चन वाई लेस एक्स इज एक्स माइनस वन सेकेंड गाइस वन सेकेंड Yeah. So let me pick questions from a different book where we have a lot of questions. Is <laughs> everyone getting confused because like the way like variables x y not numbers? Kita tabi to maine bola starting mein it is difficult but you will understand a little bit a little bit practice. Just because they're like variables. Yes. Otherwise, it's nothing. It's very easy. All right. I'm opening another book. So, which book? One hundred twenty second page. Dia, yeah, will you come for yoga practices? Sudaram, beta, not a time, good time to talk to each oh. other. All right. So let's do start with this easy stuff. So how will we write x added to ten? How will we write x added to ten, everyone? Ten plus x or x. So ten plus x. Ten plus x or x plus ten. Plus ten. All right. So everyone, give the answer of B and C part in the chat quickly. Ma'am, please paste the names. So Gauri, when I give two questions, send both answers in one message. So Chip, guys, quickly, Mr. Bind, Mr. Bind. But I sent mine. It's not been checked yet. Mom, please, Chip. Is this the last question of the day? No, beta. Sir, I have sent you my answer. Yes, send to ma'am from next time. 
What is my second answer? And Chetty, where is my answer? Sir, I sent to ma'am. Okay. So, sum of y and 5 is y plus 5. x added to y is x plus y. As simple as that. All right. Yes or no? Yes, sir. So, do the D and E part. So, I will give one minute. So, now who was not able to understand? Have we understood now? So, you have to do C and E, right? Yes, D and E, better D and E. Okay, sir. Excuse me, sir. Yes. Sir, can we say algebra and uh, linear equations are related? Beta, linear equation, ye jo pura hum kar rahe na, linear equation is a part of algebra. Okay, sir. So, Mr. Gauri, answer bol do bhai. Two plus z. Two plus z. Yes, twelve increased by x means मुझे twelve increase करना है x में. So it will you can write x plus twelve. You can write twelve plus x. Two more than z. You can write z plus two. You can write two plus z. Anything. All right. Now next the sum of x and three added to y. Now we have to add the sum of x and 3. The sum of x and 3 will be x plus 3. Correct? Any doubts? No. Now I have put the brackets because this sum I have to add to y. So plus y. Understood? Yes. So this is beta English. When we forming algebraic expressions, karte hai, so we have to understand to convert basic English statements into algebraic expressions. Then those algebraic expressions will change to linear equations. So Adhya, have you understood? Yes, Adhya. sir. So Adhya, can you try giving the G part as the answer? Yes, sir. What's my answer for G part? So rest everyone can try doing the A part and B part. No. Yeah, A part and uh, C part. A part and C part. Yes, Adhya, what will be my answer for G part? So y added to the sum of x and 7. So x plus 7, y added to this sum means y plus x plus 7. So x decreased by 4. So it will be x minus 4. y less than y. 7 less than y, which will be y minus 7. So kids, do the b and d part. This too I have explained to the b and d part. 
सो सी एक्स डिक्रीज बाय फोर मीन्स आप एक्स को लेस कर रहे हो फोर से मीन्स यू आर सब्रैक्टिंग फोर फ्रॉम एक्स सेवन लेस देन बाय मीन्स आप बाय को सेवन से लेस कर रहे हो ट्राई कन्वर्टिंग इट इन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज All right. So what will be y decreased by x? So y को मुझे कम करना है किससे x से एट रिड्यूस बाय z. एट को मुझे कम करना है किससे z से बेटा वी आर जस्ट स्टार्टेड ना सो इट्स ओके Now guys, give the answer of E part, and uh, that's it. Just E part, and that's the last question for today. Give the answer of E part. But I'm still not understanding. So like y decreased by x will be x minus y decreased so, by x. Up y ko decrease kar rahe ho by x. Yes sir. So x is the minimum, so it will come in the front. No, beta no. This is ab ye English hai. You will have to help yourself. Thoda sa this is not mathematics. Thoda sa khud ko help karna padega ki y is y decreased by x is y minus x. Thoda sa question yourself. This is English language, Javi. Oh, sir, understood now. Yes. So help yourself a little bit. अपने वाय को कम किया x से. Yes. Gradually we'll get used to it. Don't worry. This is the first class. We'll do in the next class also. Third class that will be perfect. So smiley, keep your camera on. So Mahuri, what should be my answer? So the answer should be x minus ten. Yes, ten less than x. Up x ko ten se less kar do, so it will be x minus ten. All right. So okay, kids, that's all for today. Bye bye. Enjoy. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Bye. Bye, sir. Thank you, sir. Bye, sir. Bye bye.